Good morning guys, what's going on? Welcome back to another video. As you can tell, it is very dark, I am very tired, and it is very early. We're starting the video off at four o'clock this morning. Show you if that focuses. And we are heading to film in Watford with the Future Fit Creative team. Uh, directed by my brother and um, we've got a wicked day so it's like my first proper job as a videographer i'm going there we're trying to get there early to catch a sunrise with the drone and i'm just going to film sort of a, a bit for future fit but also for my channel and for their new channel that's just launched future fit tv behind the scenes it's going to be wicked i think it's going to be the first proper video on future fit tv as well so that's going to be sweet heading there now i hope you enjoy this video I'm going to stick a bit of Gary V on, listen to a podcast all the way up, and smash it. So, uh, hope you enjoy. Smash the thumbs up button. I'll see you in a bit. Can I get a large uh, Alan of Love take piece for an extra shot? Damn, it feels good to be up and out already. Was it five o'clock? We've got our coffee. Happy days. Oh, that's good. And now it's time to roll on to the rugby club and meet the team. So that's going to be good. Let's roll onto this camera and get some more B roll footage. See you in a sec. Once again. So we have made it to the destination, which is Radlett Rugby Club. Um, I'm here with Louis, brackets, right. elder bro. Let me come over here. Go come over here. So Lou is directing the whole sort of thing today. You've been here since Monday? Monday morning, yeah, Monday morning. Doing a bit of recce, filming some stuff yesterday. Yeah, we've got car away, city stuff. And then now I'm here to help out with some drone stuff and also film some behind the scenes stuff. So what's the sort of idea behind this video? Just so, so we just want to get some behind the scenes of what it's like to shoot on a day-to-day -day basis with here, the production team at FutureFit. Um, today we're shooting a guy called Craig O'Toole who runs his own business called Man Alive, which is a fitness kind of boot camp style. Um, 12 and week he, up so, up so he um, graduated through FutureFit? Yeah, 2008, long time ago. Um, he's gone on to become a personal trainer and then set up this company. He's been doing so for about five Five years now. Uh, they've got a couple of locations around Hertfordshire, about 200 members across the locations. Yeah. So Specialising in outdoor training, you know, it's wicked. really different. Yeah, really different, especially to what I do. So I'm even going to get some tips and some inspiration here in terms of personal training. Um, but the whole idea behind this Future Fit video is to show like what happens postgraduate and where you're going to try and get in loads of different people sure. and show yeah, out yeah. what they do once they get qualified. So let's show you some behind the scenes stuff, let's show you some drone footage and uh, yeah, carry on enjoying the video. Give me death, there ain't no other choices When I lay down and go to sleep, I keep on hearing voices Little whispers in my head, man, is you fake or loyal? Why no water, death to sign the baby, pick your poison These little demons living underneath my bed, creeping Know the real monster lives above them all, sleeping That subtle breathing in your closet every single evening Thought you never see me again, looks can be deceiving When they hear the sound of the drum They'll be saying, oh Lord, here they come yeah, here we come. Huh, here we come. Okay, so we're also joined by Elliot. You've only just started working for Future, haven't you? Yeah, started um, three weeks ago. How's it all going? It's been great, man. It's been great so far. So far, so yeah, good. So, so he's been here with Lou since Monday as well, yeah? Mm hmm. Since um, Monday. They're warming up back there. They've got a pretty sweet circuit lined up. I've just got some drone shots and them warming up. The boys are getting some behind the scenes footage and I'm definitely going to take some inspiration from all this. They're doing sort of a strength and conditioning session they said today. Is that what they said Lou? And then... Yeah, it's like a mixture of strength and conditioning and um, like personal training workout or personal training boot camp style. Sweet. So yeah, let's roll some more footage by the way. Always rocking that RC fitness. 
got to be done getting the name out there, haven't we? So, uh, yeah, let's enjoy. So, we finished shoot one, uh, which was a morning scene of the boot camp. Yeah. 6 a.m. to 7 a.m. session. Yeah. Went really well, bloody freezing. Very cool. It went pretty well. These two chaps are going to talk to you about sort of what equipment they're using to film, obviously, I'm on the RX100 and just use the drone. And then I also got some slow motion on my phone for that edit. These two have got the big guns. We'll go for it now. So Lou, you go first. So I've been using the um, Canon 5D Mark III, which is the camera that I've used for a little while now. Um, just with the kit 24 to 105 millimeter lens on it. Been shooting that on the uh, DJI Ronin. So right, the show Ronin it, because it's not in uh, the not in shot. No, so that's the big so setup. Low. So this is it, this is the Ronin MX. This is how we use it, obviously get it all balanced, a lovely gimbal, keep, keep the shots nice and steady, really good for tracking shots, um, adding a bit of movement, a bit of, you know, a bit of dynamic to the shots, making it a little bit more engaging, hopefully. Um, yeah, so we've been shooting on that. Elliot, you've been shooting on? The GH5. Uh, Panasonic, isn't it? Panasonic Lumix, yeah. Uh, 4K camera, but obviously we're doing 4 HD today, so it's just on 1080p at the moment. Um, fixed onto it is the Sirui monopod, I think. I uh, saw some good reviews in it online. It's pretty, it's, it's pretty good piece of kit to be fair. Yeah. And the Manfrotto fluid head as well. Um, Wicked. Yeah. It's just good kit. Yeah, it's a good kit, man. Big That's setup. Good. So one day the vlog, the vlog setups will be like that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right. So the game plan now is we've got to get some active track shots of the car pulling up because we missed that this morning. Uh, we're gonna go for breakfast. And then meet back up for workout. his workout. Yeah. We're gonna film behind the scenes of that as well. Team, we're here at this second location. This time it's a different rugby field, and we're here to watch and film what Cray work out this when he's getting his own session in. So we're just going to try and get a bit of footage of how he's training. Um, today he said he's got he's training for something quite specific, so we're going to get uh, some footage of that, get the drone back up, the sun to come out now, which looks bloody lovely. So yeah, uh, a few more drone sh shots, a few more bits of um, footage of Craig. And then I think that's all done because they've done a lot of their filming yesterday on the old, um, at his house and sort of the behind the scenes stuff. So, yeah, wicked stuff. Let's see some more videos. Okay, guys, so we are back at the Starbs. Shit, sure, Cora. Um, just sending Lou all this footage and vice versa so we can make some sweet videos. Really excited to see what Lou and Elliot come up with uh, for Future Fit TV, TV. And obviously, my vlog should probably be totally different, so it'll be quite cool to see how we uh, edit the videos and see how different they are. But really enjoyed sort of coming out and putting my little piece towards the video and flying the drone and stuff, and hopefully helping and adding value to the video. So, yeah, when the video does go live, I'll either link it in this video or the next video. But yeah, it will definitely be on the channel. Obviously, Future Fit's always linked below, and now I'm going to start linking Future Fit TV as the YouTube channel as well. So, Lou's going to kill that edit, sat in this beautiful sunshine. Um, so, I hope you enjoyed this little vloggy. Uh, video the first sort of video first one if you have any questions in terms of cameras and stuff let me know down below we'll speak to this man and he'll, uh, he'll, he'll hook it up but yeah wicked day i'll catch you in the next video don't forget to subscribe <laughs>